Meantime, a last minute push is on to make sure kids in the East Bay have something to open on Christmas morning. A local charity says that they're short almost 800 gifts tonight. Kelsey Thord is in San Leandro, where the Davis Street Family Center is hoping for some holiday help. Well, Davis Street's annual holiday basket giveaway is this Saturday, and there are just a few more days for people to donate. And the organization says they are in need. They still need hundreds of toys and gifts for kids, especially for teenagers. So this is 13 and up. So basically, this is usually all we get. So we have like a couple of headphones, some bassets, and like a little bit of like a throw blanket and some little purses. It's not very much. And in this age category, we have close to 200. Each holiday season, Davis Street in San Leandro gives out thousands of bags filled with toys to local families in need. This year, things have been slower than usual. And with just days until the giveaway, organizers say they still need toy donations for close to 800 kids. Christmas is a week from now. and. And we're kind of, you know, starting to get a little worried and, and fing, you know, crossing fingers and toes and inviting the community to, to, you know, get out there, get those toys. Organizers say the highest need is gifts for kids over the age of seven all the way to 16. Those are the ages that a lot, a lot of people want to buy toys for. They're a little bit harder because they're older. And that's usually the time right now with electronics to come in. So mm -hmm. a lot of kids are more electronic. And so things that are you know, remote control cars, things like that, basketballs, any type of stuff like that we can get for them. Legos is great. Davis Street says they believe the drop in donations this year is a symptom of the overall economy. A lot of families, not just here in San Leandro, are struggling this year. Well, you know, interest rates are higher. There's, there's so much going on. There's, you know, wars. There's, there's, there's things going on in, in the world that I know trickle down and affect everyone. Still, organizers are hopeful they will reach their donation goal this final week. Then comes the fun part. You know, they, they see a bag of toys coming into their car and their, their faces light up. They're just, you know, so happy to see something for Christmas. Now, organizers say they will continue taking donations through Saturday. The giveaway itself will begin at 8 a.m. on Saturday, and they say they are going to give out close to 2,000 bags of toys.